Hello, welcome back to another lecture. In this lecture, we are going to be learning how to rearrange your features in your feature manager tree. So download this part file so you can follow along. In order to rearrange the features in your feature manager tree, there is one rule involved. And that rule is that the features you are trying to rearrange has to be independent of each other. In this example, let's look at extrude cut 1, which is this hole, and fillet 2. Looking at both features, you can tell that they are independent of, of each other, meaning that they don't rely on each other. So in that case, I should be able to move fillet 2 above extrude cut 1. And to move it, all you have to do is click on the feature, left click, hold and drag it up until you see that arrow and once you see that arrow that says move above and just drop it on again fillet 2 is not depending on fillet 1 so I can move fillet 2 above fillet 1 you rearrange your features and so I'm just going to move my fillet 2 back so I'm going to click left click hold and drag and move it below fillet 1 so I have fillet 1 and fillet 2 and let's try another example let's look at extrude bus 2 and fillet 1 we can see that fillet 1 is applied to extrude bus 2 so that means that fillet 1 is depending on extrude bus 2 so if I try to move fillet 1 above extrude bus 2 you can see it it wouldn't let me move it but I can move it below fillet 2 but I can't move it above extrude bus 2 so that is the rule you have to keep in mind any any feature that are independent of each other you will be able to rearrange them but any features that are depending on each other they have to follow the same order in which they were made so that is how you rearrange your features in SOLIDWORKS. Thank you and I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.